Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Tired Axe Outdoors. Today we're really excited. We're going to be unboxing some new gear. Um, we're going to go out, we're going to get it set up in the living room, and we're going to get to it. Thanks. All right, guys, here's the new fish house boxed up. Let's go ahead and get it unboxed. Insulated series is supposed to be roughly 35% warmer. Uh, so here in Minnesota, that's going to be pretty nice when it gets down below zero. Let's see. I'm going to have the box. I'll let you guys take a look at the box here quick. So we also got the Eskimo drill adapter. And so you can run the anchors in with your cordless drill, which we also use for our auger, so it works out. All right, let's lift it out of there, buddy. There we go. All right. So as you guys can see, it's manageable with one person. I think they say it weighs roughly 40 pounds. So there's the box. Let's go ahead and get it opened up, and we'll get this set up. This will be our first new fish house we've had, so we're really excited to get this out of the ice this weekend and uh, check it out. So, um, all right. Up, get it off, carry bags. <laughs> Sorry, neighbors, if you're watching. All right, do you want to hold the fish house? Oh, sit over there. Get the box out of the way. So, this is it. So, part of you know, something that, that Colton said, something that we that led us to wanting to buy a hub house is that we do live in an apartment, so a space is limited. Um, I also drive a small car, so we're trying to get our ice fishing gear to the point where we can haul everything in a car and store in our apartment. So super, this is going to be huge it's, for us. It's super nice that it has a shoulder strap. Yeah, the carry case is really, really nice. Oh, okay, I can't put it on here. Yeah. All right, so we're going to get set up here. We'll pop this up and we'll... Uh, Guys, as you can see, this thing is massive. The, the footprint is 70 by 70 inside, and then with the hubs popped out, it's even larger than that for elbow room. But floor space, this is more than enough for two anglers, um, and, you know, even three uh, if you guys tighten up just a little bit. So we're gonna go ahead and step inside. First impressions are, and this thing, this is it's really, really nice. The heavy duty zippers, the insulated canvas and fabric is, is really, really nice. Unzip that. Yeah, look at these big doors. You can step in and out. Colton was in there getting the the uh, plastic out of the window. So, all right, guys, we got a light up inside. Let's step in and check it out. Nice big doors. Like I said, this thing is really, really big. We had the doors zipped up, we had the windows closed, and it blocks out all the lights. So you could also use this as a spear house if you'd like. Um, we just have an LED light hanging from the hub up top, and that's plenty of light in this floor space. Once again, I, I, I'm overly impressed as to how thick and heavy this canvas is. I've had some other shelters in the past that the, the canvas is nowhere near this heavy. So great job, great uh, work to Eskimo on that. Um, yeah, this is gonna be really nice. We're gonna get a interlocking floor mats and put a floor kit in this so that we're gonna be up off the ice. We're not gonna be sitting in the slush, anything like that. So it's gonna be really nice. Um, yeah, this is gonna be good for us going out fishing as a family, isn't it? Can yeah. I show them something? Yeah. All right, wait, I wanna show them how dark it gets. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll get everything closed up here and then uh, well, we'll just let you guys see. We'll hang out for a minute while he gets the doors closed up. Yeah. How do you feel about the fish house? We got one more light and one more window to close here. 
All right, so let's go ahead and get this All light right. shut off. All right, so that is inside with the uh, the lights off. So like I said, it's dark. <laughs> um, that's not, and that's with this door barely closed. Yeah, it'll work really, really good at keeping the light out. That's how dark it really is. Yep, there's the light back on. So this is, this turns really bright. Yeah, it does. I mean, it's, it's it works really good. And I mean, the the whole floor space is all lit like up. Like from that to when it's off. Yep, exactly. It's yep. crazy. Just a couple of final thoughts on this. I mean, I'm six foot tall and I can stand up in here um, anywhere in the fish house. If I get right up against the wall, my head touches. But still, there's so much fishable and usable space in here for for getting outside with kids and a family. Um, we, you know, we're gonna put the floor mats in. We're gonna set up our chairs, get everything, you know, taken care of the way we want it. Um, we're even looking at some of the 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 wall hubs that you would use inside of a wheelhouse that you can add attachments to uh, camera mounts, you know, for underwater camera, anything like that, rod holders, rattle reels. So this is really going to open up our options. Um, one other thing I noticed too is that the the vents on the sides actually have a cover on the outside. And uh, I'm going to flip the camera here for you guys. And they actually have a cover on the outside to keep the snow outside, but obviously you still have the vent. We have those on both sides. So that's pretty nice. And uh, once again, you know, the next time we have this out, we're going to be out on the ice. So uh, stay tuned and thanks for watching. See ya.